and that's it for fun. That was so much fun. Thank you so much for spending all that money on me. Today is going to be a really fun day for this fan because me and me are going to be spending the day together and we're going to be going makeup shopping and having some super girly time, aren't we? This is going yeah. to be fun and little keep calm and you get to come with us as well, don't you? Aww. You excited to look at loads of makeup? Yeah? <laughs> Do you want to? What's good, Fizz Fam? What's Hope you're having good? an amazing day or evening. Today is going to be a really fun day for us, obviously, because we're going to get to go makeup shopping to Sephora. If you don't know what Sephora is, it's basically a massive beauty shop. It's all, like, all over the USA. It's also in other parts of the world, like even the UK. And they just sell such a huge selection of makeup. You're going to have get to have a really good shop in there. Basically, we last went makeup shopping for Mia. She got like a makeup bag full of makeup when... It was about two years ago, wasn't yeah, it, Mia? when, it was when, when Mia was 12 so obviously two years of no part she's nearly 14 and a lot of her makeup's got quite old now also her skin has changed and her taste and her style in makeup yeah. as well hasn't it so I feel like Mia needs some new makeup and also she wants to make loads of fun videos for you over on her channel Mia's life where she can show you like how like her looks that she can make out of the makeup and like just some tutorials as well because yeah. she's like having a fun experimenting but we also when we go into Sephora we're gonna like try and find stuff which is also vegan and cruelty free so Mia's done a little bit of research haven't you yeah and she's looked at all the different brands and she's like noted down which stuff Stuff is going to be vegan, so that's going to be cool. And there seems to be a lot of choice, doesn't there? Yeah, there's there so much to so choose from, which is it's amazing. Crazy. And also, Mia might get a bit of advice from the people who work in there because yeah. obviously she's got fair skin and red hair, so she really wants to choose colours which will make her eyes and her skin pop, and which will complement her hair. Because I think last time we did the makeup haul, basically we went into like a little local super drug, so there wasn't much choice in there. Yeah. And like Mia, did, you didn't really know like what makeup yeah. to go and for. And also, some of the lighter oh. shades were like still too dark for me. And things like that so hopefully they have stuff that will like be light enough for me so today it's gonna be nice and fun obviously we're gonna get to do some makeup shopping we also got an hour's walk till we get to where Sephora is we're gonna be going to one in the Hollywood Center like the center of Hollywood and that's about an hour away so we've got a little bit of a walk to do but that's gonna be fun because we're here sightseeing and exploring the place so should we get a move on then yes let's go we're almost at Sephora now we're actually on the Hollywood strip so it's super busy but surprisingly even though that was like a mile and a half walk it actually went really quickly like I don't feel tired at all which I'm glad about right we're almost there I I can see it mum yeah Sephora over there are you excited Woo! yeah I'm so you've excited got that hug behind you oh <laughs> hey woo I'm so excited. I don't really know where I'm gonna start. I feel like I'm gonna try and do this like methodically so I don't miss out on anything, like I miss something, because I know for definite that will probably happen. <laughs> And I know this brand is by Rihanna and it's supposed to be really good because it's supposed to be good for all skin tones So hopefully they'll have some stuff that will suit my skin tone, which is very fair And I think that both of their lip glosses are vegan. Oh, yeah I'm not sure I don't feel like that many of the products are vegan though because I think they have like lots of like beeswax and stuff like that So we'll see if we can find some stuff, but these yeah. look so good. Yeah, I the feel gloss like box. you got that one Did you? Yeah, this before? is meant to suit all everybody. It's meant to be yeah. universal I haven't tried this, but I feel like that's that quite, looks really nice. That'd be nice though. for you, Mia. Wow. Yeah. Look. <gasps> They're so oh, pretty. Do you like that caramel? It says it's yeah. nourishing wear as well. Ooh. So that's going to be like some things dry my lips. Like, do they dry your lips, like, Mia? Um. Yes. Yeah, sometimes. Yeah. Look how pretty this is. Wow. I think this. Looking at all of her range, I think this is my favorite of all of it. I think I'm going to get this lip gloss because I absolutely love lip gloss. I wear it every single day and this just looks so pretty. Yeah, your lip gloss has run out so quickly. I know, yeah, right. So this one is it, Diamond Milk. Right, I'm going to put this in my basket. I reckon we're probably going to get a lot of products and put them all in the basket and then at the end I'm probably going to go through and see which ones I actually like, I'm really going to use and which ones I really like. So let's have a look at the next brand. Ooh, what's that, Wow. Mean? I think this is highlights and blush. 
Look how pretty <gasps> oh. it is. It's amazing. We're looking at Kat Von D right now and all of her stuff is vegan because she's actually vegan herself. So that makes it really easy to find which products. I already have some lipsticks and they're kind of like sort of balmy ones. I kind of like that sort of style if I am to go to get one of them. Look at this little cute palette, Fizz Fam. It's actually a highlighter palette. Look how pretty wow. these are. They're so gorgeous. I love this purpley one. Look, and they're super high pigment as well. That's it, there. It's lovely, it's yeah. so beautiful. I think I'm probably gonna put one of these in my basket, and if I see another highlighter, then I'll probably get that one instead, but this one does look really good. Oh, wow. I love the shape of that. Look, it's all the cover is holographic. Wow. This looks so pretty. Oh, do you know what, Mia? It also says it's good for cheeks and lips as well. Oh, wow. So you can use it in like the corner of your eyes and stuff. And so, so like your lips. You could have yeah. a really cool look. Oh, wow. That would be so pretty. Woo! This brand I've seen before, but I've never ever got any products from here. And it looks really good. It's 100% vegan. It's called Milk. And oh, some yeah, of the look, products yeah. Look super pretty. You wouldn't think it was vegan this. though if it's called no, Milk. No, you wouldn't. Oh, do you like this then, Karma? It's Probably. called Milk, yeah. Wow, it's everything looks cheap. really cool. Do you know what I like about this? They all look kind of fun because they're in yeah. different kind of packagings. Wow, like match your cleanser. All these cleansers and skin oh, wow. tints. Wow. So I'm getting excited for you. <laughs> I've been looking at this brand and I feel like I'm probably going to leave it for today just because the things that I can see that look really nice are these little highlighters, but obviously I've already got that highlighter palette, so I don't really need it. And I feel like the one from Kat Von D actually looks better. So we're going to move on. I feel like something that I'm probably going to get a lot of stuff from is Tarte, which is here. So I'm really excited to have a look at it. What one thing that I do really want though is like a sort of foundation that's very like basically like a BB cream or a tinted primer. I think that would be really nice. So a light foundation. So they have some here. I'm going to have a look and see which ones I like. But these Amazonian clay looks really good. Is that the lightest color? Yeah, this is the lightest color that they do. I'm going to try it on my face because if I did swatch it on my hand, obviously my hands is a bit more tanned than my face and I obviously don't want it to be too dark if not that wouldn't look good. What do you think? Yeah they're splendid and really well yeah. actually. You have already got makeup on though. Yeah I've got bronzer on so my face will be slightly oh, you've darker. Got, you've got nothing on then apart from bronzer. No I've got bronzer and concealer and stuff okay. but bronzer is going to make my face a little bit darker than it naturally is. But okay, yeah. Let me have a look at your jaw. Yeah, I guess you would be the lightest, wouldn't you? You know, it's yeah. like you're going to be medium or no, medium. I feel like that actually looks really good. The lighting's not like ideal in here, but I just feel like I know that I'm going to be the lightest shade. I'm always the lightest shade. So which one is that then? This is the Amazonian Clay BB Tinted Moisturizer. I think that's got sun cream in as well, yeah, which it's is got great. Yeah, it's 20 in it, which oh, is brilliant. Amazing. Yeah. But right, you better go and get a new one then. Yes. Because one time when we went, can you remember we did the 12 year old shop? When you went shopping, yeah. didn't you actually bring one home that had been used? Did I? Yeah, didn't we bring one home? That. that was a tester. Oh, I'm sure did you did. Accidentally. Yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this is it. There we go. And it's ah. in my shade as well. Oh. Okay, brilliant. Let's see what else we can find by the really wanted to get from Tarte is the eyebrow stuff where it's like an eyebrow brush and you can brush it through. They unfortunately don't have it. Look, they only have pencils and I already have some eyebrow powder and I thought that maybe they would have it in here but they obviously only sell it online because I was so excited to try that. That was like something I've been really wanting for ages. So maybe I'm gonna have to wait until they have it in the store or I'm gonna have to buy it online but I don't really want to do that because I don't have a clue what color I'm gonna be because I feel like I'm probably gonna be like blonde but then at the same time I'm not sure if that might be like too light or if it might look wrong on me and I just feel like ordering makeup online is sometimes a bit difficult because like you just need to be able to test it on your face. Because I didn't have the eyebrow stuff I've been looking at all of Tarte and I can only find one more thing which would be kind of nice and it's like these tinted lip balms but they're $20 and mum said that she got one before and it got used up really fast so I'm thinking is it really gonna be worth it so I'm gonna have a look at some other brands and then maybe I can go back to it or maybe I'll find something else instead. First fan, we're now at Too Faced and I was like, so excited to come to Too Faced because basically they have this new like tropical juicy fruits range and it looks so good but unfortunately they don't have it at this Sephora. However, they do have the peachy range and I've never had it before but this lip balm looks so good. The peachy lip balm. Look at that and it looks, I'm wearing it now so it's very natural and it feels so moisturizing and 
it smells so good for this fam. I absolutely love the peach range because it just smells amazing. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna put it in the basket. Maybe if I see another lip balm, I'll get something instead, but this looks really good. What are you looking at? Eyeliner. Look at this pink. How high pigmented that is. Wow. I'm not sure if I'm necessarily gonna go for the pink look because I feel like that's probably quite, I want something a little bit more natural. So I'm gonna have a look at these sorts of colors. Look at wow, that. Wow, that looks that's lovely. Really pretty. Oh, so you're not going to go for the regular black eyeliner? Because that's no. what I normally always go for, black no. eyeliner. I want to go for something that's a little bit more interesting, a little bit more natural, I think. Fizz fam, I changed my mind and I've swatched lots of them and I decided that the pink actually looks really nice and I did put a little bit on my face. I've wiped it off now, of course. Um, but I thought that it looked really nice. But unfortunately, Fizz fam, look. This is where the pink should be and they've obviously ran out, which is really sad. Maybe we can ask some staff if there's any like in stock at the back. But I really like that eyeliner otherwise. Fizz fam, I'm looking in the mini section because I feel like this is my favorite section because I just feel like they're so cute. I love little minis makeup. And I was looking in the Urban Decay section and I really wanted to get their setting spray, but I didn't want to get a full size one. And look, they have it here in it as a mini. Look at this, this is their all nighter setting spray. Look how cute this is. Oh, you want to get a mini one? Yes. I yeah. think these are good because they're more travel friendly. I think they're about half the price of the big one. Yeah. And I think that minis last for ages. Yeah. Do you know what, we'll probably get loads of samples for free as well, Mia. Oh yeah, yeah, because okay. we're getting quite a lot. So have you got everything you wanted then? I feel like, yeah, I'm going to have another look through the minis, but I feel like I've probably got most of what I want. Because if I get more stuff, then it's just kind of unnecessary and I'm just getting also, stuff that I don't actually birthday need. birthday and Christmas is coming up soon, Mia. Yes, yeah. So yeah. what if you couldn't get today? I've literally remembered in my head what you like. <laughs> oh, so you never you. know. You may get them for your birthday for Christmas, okay? Ooh. So I've actually come back to Urban Decay and I found an eyeliner and a lip gloss so the eyeliner that I found was this really glittery sort of silvery one look at this this is beautiful and this is in the heavy metal I didn't notice these at first so this is the one I've got and it just looks so pretty and I have actually got one of these heavy metal ones before but that one was slightly pinky so now I've got another one to choose from and then also I've got this lip gloss which I'm now wearing now and it's this back talk one and I have got some other lip glosses from this like collection and it's so good I absolutely love these lip glosses and I feel like this color is really nice and apparently this color is supposed to be really popular that they actually made an eyeshadow palette of this lip gloss or actually I think it was lipstick of this lip gloss <laughs> right Fizz fam I think I'm done I've got everything that I wanted thank you so much for this mom oh, I'm really you. really happy with everything I got I'm I can't wait to put them on. on thank you and you can show the Fizz fam well yes. you can show the Mia cool. yes so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a big haul where I'm going to go into detail of all the stuff that I've bought today. And that's it for this fun. That was so much fun. Thank you so much for spending all that money on me, Mom. You're welcome. And thank you for getting all of that. That was Well, we probably have so to do this fun. every couple of years. Because yeah. if you think about it, makeup does go, like, you're not many use after so long as a bacteria. Yeah, and plus it yeah. gets a bit dry and stuff. I know that you're always making videos and showing your makeup off. You deserve it, okay? Oh, thank you, Mom. Anyways, yeah. now it's time to go home. Phew, we managed to make it back, Fizz fam. And look at this. What a wonderful sight this is. Look, one cute little happy baby, and then all this wow. amazing makeup. Look at this. Are you happy, Mia? Well, obviously, I'm you said so you're happy, happy, aren't you? Yeah, you yeah. are happy. That's That goes without saying, I guess. <laughs> what girl wouldn't be happy with a whole load of, of makeup? makeup. <laughs> so what I'm now going to be doing is filming a haul of all of the makeup. Oh, wow, Carmen, you're rolling over. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> of all of this makeup, I'm going to be going into detail and what I'm going to be using it for and all sorts of stuff like that on my channel, Mia's Life. Also, guys, if you're new to our channel, don't forget to subscribe because we don't only just make videos about makeup and shopping, we also make fun challenge videos like 24 hours in our car and bathroom. We also make fun vlogs and we usually like take you along in our journey as well as a family, as we travel, as we do silly and crazy stuff, do things like having a baby, moving house, getting married, loads of fun yeah. stuff like that as well, guys, because our aim is to make you smile every day and we feel like that is the most important thing to do in the world is to make people smile, make them feel good about themselves and hopefully you can learn with us as we learn from our mistakes, as all the things that we take on. Also guys, don't forget to comment down below your favorite cruelty-free makeup brand and what your favorite product is by them. Thank you so much for watching guys and we'll Thank see you in our you. next video. Stay busy! Bye. Bye.